Hello again and welcome to Biomed RX TV. This is Devin Lockett. I got a special show for you today. I want to talk about uh, an invention of mine uh, that I think would be very helpful um, for your general health, um, your well-being, helping you feel better, and helping people to overcome the effects of uh, drugs and alcohol uh, abuse throughout their lives and maybe to prevent stroke, uh, cleansing the brain, cleansing the pineal gland, and, uh, and the sinuses and everything. We're talking about um, my special scalp elixir. Uh. All right, now to mix the scalp elixir, we're going to have to get some haritake. That's right, haritake, also known as kaduka podi. Uh, in India, which is the king of all herbs. Haritake, in and of itself, is very good for cleansing, uh, cleansing the brain, cleansing the pineal gland, cleansing the digestive tract. Um, it's very good for getting rid of bad karma, believe it or not. It gets rid of negative thoughts and negative beliefs in the brain. It's very good. It's good on the, uh, it's good physically. It's known as the uh, mother of all herbs in India or the king of all herbs and it's also uh, good spiritually it's uh, also good for manifesting wealth I did one video on Haritake you can find that if you click right here and I just recently completed another video um, on uh, how to use Haritake uh, you can find that one if you click right here as well um, this video is a third, the third video about Haritake, and I'm going to be talking about how to mix a scalp elixir. So you see right here we have a little bit of Haritake in um, the, uh, I guess we call this a shot glass or a little cup, okay? The last video was about how to uh, use Haritake to manifest wealth, and we spoke about how to do that, uh, basically rubbing it on your gums, and you can find that video uh, if you click here as well. Um, now, what do we do? We take a little bit of Haritake, okay, and we mix it with a little bit of DMSO, dimethyl sulfoxide. Dimethyl sulfoxide is good for the brain as well because it is good for increasing the permeability of the, of the cells so it prevents blood clots which uh, would prevent you from uh, having a stroke okay um, it's very good uh, it also prevents swelling of the brain um, which could cause paralysis and as you can see I'm mixing a pretty generous amount of uh, DMSO in with this Haritake because I mixed a pretty generous amount of Haritake. Okay. And you can see the DMSO is soaking into the Haritake. All right. And I'm going to get a mixer here, actually a little spoon, and I'm going to mix this up. Okay. the Haritake powder, you mix it with DMSO, and you may actually get a little warmth. You may actually feel a little heat from this reaction, okay? Now, as you can see, it mixes into a nice brown paste, all right? Put a little bit more DMSO in there. Get it a little softer. A little more liquid. Okay. Now DMSO is good by itself. Okay. It uh, is, is a good pain reliever. Um, it's a good muscle relaxant. If you drink, if you dilute DMSO in water and drink it, uh, you'll find that it's very relaxing to your body. It also uh, relaxes all of the nerve endings associated with pain. DMSO is very good for taking right before you go to workout. You can get a really good workout uh, if you drink a, about, about five to ten drops of DMSO in a cup of water um, before you go uh, to work out. So now here you have DMSO 
mixed with harataki in a paste. And so what do you do with this before you go to bed? You put it right on your head. Put it right on your scalp, you see? Okay, that's why this is called the scalp elixir, all right? The DMSO Harataki Scalp Elixir. Now, what does this do? The DMSO carries everything through the skin, everything that it binds to through the skin, and also across the blood-brain barrier, okay? So, what's, what's happening here is I am putting DMSO onto my scalp, DMSO with Harataki onto my scalp, you do this right before you go to bed. Make sure your skin is clean, your head is clean. Make sure you even rinse off all of the soap with which you cleaned your head and the shampoo because DMSO will carry whatever it binds to directly into your bloodstream, okay? But this is what you want. I know it looks really, really messy, okay? But if you do this on your crown before you go to bed, you will find that the DMSO carries the harataki across the skin and through the blood-brain barrier, okay? You will be cleansing your brain as you sleep. You will get rid of the, the residue, the effects of uh, drugs and alcohol uh, use and abuse throughout your life. You will also um, feel a profound sense of mental clarity. You're gonna find yourself blowing your nose because it's going to also clear your sinuses. It's going to clear out your, your sinuses as well. And um, yeah, it's really good. Now, of course, what I recommend is pretty, what I recommend because it's pretty messy, right? As you can see, it's pretty messy. Uh, put on a shower cap, right? After you do it, put on a shower cap. If you're experiencing a headache, then put a little bit on your temples right here, right? and a little bit on your third eye chakra, as you can see right here, okay? It'll get rid of the temple, I mean, get rid of the headache immediately, all right? I know this looks very messy, but that's why I wanted to do this on video so I can show you exactly how it's done, okay? This is the scalp elixir. This is the biometrics scalp elixir, okay? Highly recommended. A little bit of DMSO mixed with harataki on the scalp, okay? And if you wanna make sure that it will penetrate the skin, you can just add a little DMSO on top, okay? This is the pure DMSO. You can add a little DMSO on top, okay? There you go. Gets it liquefied, gets it really soaking in there. Gets it going into you. And you can do it over your whole head. You don't have to just put it here on the crown chakra. You can do it everywhere on your head. Uh, like I said, I was rubbing it on my temples. It's good for uh, stopping headaches, um, stopping headaches in their tracks, okay? Now, I am going to, uh, as always with our, our videos, I'm gonna talk about um, some other things that you can do to make this scalp elixir more effective, but this is going to be reserved for our Patreon audience. So, excuse me, YouTubers, once again. All right, for the Patreon audience, I wanted to talk about uh, not only how to make the uh, scalp elixir, but also to make it better using Biomed RX CBD, okay? Biomed RX CBD oil. Our CBD oil is the purest that you can get. Um, no glyphosates, no uh, organically grown, no glyphosates and no uh, pesticides uh, were used, okay? So we just take a little bit of, uh, actually we should use a little bit less than that because our CBD oil is very, very powerful. Uh, take a little bit of CBD oil and add it to the DMSO Harataki elixir, okay? The CBD oil, um, also will be carried through the skin and across the blood-brain barrier by uh, the DMSO and um, it will reach your CB1 and CB2 receptors. Um, it's also good for stopping pain and uh, stopping headaches um, but it's also really good. The most important uh, reason that you're adding this 
uh, uh, CBD oil is so that it can help you sleep at night. So the uh, DMSO is a good muscle relaxer. Uh, the Haritaki is a very good cleanser. And the CBD oil has many benefits. Um, most importantly in this particular application is that it gives you the ability to sleep uh, more soundly, uh, to relax, gets rid of pain. Um, it's very good, very good stuff. So here you have it. This is the Biometrics Scalp Elixir, okay? This is our own invention. As you can see, little DMSO with Haritaki. And uh, if you try this, please, by all means, uh, comment below and uh, give us your, um, your feedback on how it worked for you. Like I said, it gets pretty messy. You don't want to stain your pillow. Um, so you might want to put on a shower cap before you go to bed, all right, after doing this. But you just rub it. Okay, DMSO and Haritaki mixed. And a little bit of CBD oil, all right? Um, rub it on the scalp. And get a good night's sleep. So I'm going to use the rest of this since I've already broken it open. Okay. Cleanses the brain. Most importantly, cleanses the pineal gland. Uh, once again, I have to stress if you are using fluoridated toothpaste, to, to please stop using uh, fluoridated, fluoridated toothpaste. Stop using toothpaste with fluoride in it because fluoride calcifies your pineal gland. Um, basically, that's all I have to say about this. Uh, this is our uh, scalp elixir. Okay. If you like our videos, once again, remember to hit the like button, subscribe to BiomedRx TV and to Devin Lockett, my other channel. And um, if you want to provide us with a little bit of monetary support for making these great videos, please become a patron on our Patreon channels, uh, patreon.com forward slash BiomedRx TV and patreon.com forward slash Devin Lockett. Um, if you want to buy some good merch. We've got some cool t-shirts and other merch uh, at Teespring on our Teespring catalog. The uh, link is going to be in the description below. Um, once again, please comment. Let us know about your experience with our scalp elixir. Okay. And as always, I would like everyone to stay kind because kind is the new sexy. Stay blessed and stay healthy. Thank you for watching Biomed RX TV.